keep your spine tall hands on your knees rotate your head five rounds clockwise one two three four five rotate your head in opposite direction five four three two one bring your head back to center now stretch your both hands in front of you make a fist with your hand keep your thumb inside and rotate your wrist one two three four five six seven eight nine ten opposite ten nine eight seven six five four three Two, one. Put your both palms on top of your shoulders. Rotate your elbows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Rotate in opposite direction. Ten, nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Relax your shoulders. Come into all fours position. Palms right below the shoulders. Knees right below the hip. Keep a fist gap between your both knees. Now move your shoulder forward. Take your shoulders ahead of your wrist. Exhale, bring your shoulders back. Inhale forward. Exhale back. Inhale forward. Exhale back. Inhale forward. Exhale back. One more. Inhale forward. Exhale back. Come to center. Now rotate your fingers to the side. So right palm is going to turn to the right side. Left palm to the left side. Right. Turn it to outside. Outside. Turn your palm outside. Okay. Now sway your body side to side. Move your body side to side. To the right. To the left. Right. Left. Only side to side. So that you feel the stretch on your shoulder blades. Five, four, three, two, one. Come to center. Now turn your fingers towards your knees. So right palm turns towards the right knee. Left palm turns towards the left knee. Now move your hips back towards the heels. Exhale, take your hips back. Inhale, bring it forward. Exhale, two. Move your hips towards the heels. Inhale, forward. Exhale, three. Inhale, forward. Exhale, four. Inhale, forward. Exhale, five. Hold it here for five, four, three. Two, one. Slowly start lifting your palms up. Stay back and lift your palms up. Put the weight on your fingers. Stretch your fingers. Lift up your palm and only stretch your fingers. Stay there for five, four. You are sitting on your hip. All the weight is on your hip. Hands are stretching. Four, three, two, one. And slowly lift up your palms. Now join the wrist together join your wrist and start rotating your wrist rotate your wrist for five 
four, three, two, one. Rotate it in opposite direction. One, two, three, four, and five. Relax your hand, shake out your hands. Shake it out. Now, once again, come into all fours position. Tuck in your both toes, lift your hips up, coming into inward side B. Press your heels down one at a time for five, four, push your chest towards the thighs, three, two, and one. Now slowly walk your feet forward to the front of the mat. Walk, walk, walk. Go towards the front. Have a soft bend in your knees and hold your opposite elbows. Hold the elbows. We'll be taking circle with our upper body. So you'll take your arms to the right side. Lift it up towards the ceiling. And again, lean over to your left side, creating a circle with your upper body. Try this out. Keep holding your opposite elbows while you're making the circle. Elbow. Hold your elbow. Elbow, Priyanka. Yes. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Opposite direction, five, four, three, two, and one. Inhale, slowly come up to center. Relax your palms by your sides. Now join your palms together in front of the chest, feet together. Inhale, stretch the arms up, look at your thumb. Exhale, bend forward and down, drop your palms next to the feet. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release the palms down on the mat, hop back into plank pose. If hopping is difficult, just step back into plank. Exhale, drop the knees, chest, chin, or chaturanga dandasan. Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, lift the hips up into downward facing dog. Push your chest towards the thighs. Look at your knees. Have a soft bend in your knees. Look in between your palm and hop or step forward. Touch the head to the knees and exhale out. Inhale, stretch the arms up. Look at your thumb. Exhale, bend forward and down. Drop your palms next to the feet. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release the palms down. Take the legs back into plank pose. Exhale, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin down. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inward, take B. Have a soft bend in your knees. Look in between your palms, hop or step forward. Touch the head to the knees and exhale. Inhale, stretch the arms up, look at your thumb. Exhale, bend forward and down. Bring your head and chest close to the knees. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release the palms down. Take the legs back into plank. Exhale, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inward, ten V. Soft bend in your knees, look in between your palm, hop or step forward. Touch the head to the knees and exhale. Inhale, stretch the arms up, look at your thumb. Exhale, bend forward and down. Bring your head and chest close to the knees. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release the palms down. Take the legs behind into plank pose. Exhale, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin down. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted V. Rotate your left toe 45 degree and step the right leg forward in between the palm. Inhale, lift the arms up towards the ceiling. Join the palms above your head. Look at your thumb. Exhale, bend forward and down. 
Take the right leg back into plank pose. Exhale, Chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted V. Rotate your right toe 45 degrees. Step the left leg forward. Lift the arms up. Join your palms together. Look at your thumb. Exhale, bend forward and down. Take the leg behind into plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest, chin or Chaturanga Dandasan. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted V. Soft bend in your knees. Look in between your palm, hop forward. Touch the head to the knees and exhale. Inhale, stretch the arms up. Look at your thumb. Exhale, bend forward and down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release the palms down. Take the legs back into plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest, chin, or Chaturanga Dandasan. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted B. Rotate your left toe 45 degrees. Step the right leg forward in between the palm. Lift the arms up towards the ceiling. Exhale, bend forward and down. Take the right leg back into plank pose. Exhale, Chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted V. Inhales, rotate your right toe 45 degrees. Step the left leg forward. Lift the arms up. Join the palms above your head. Exhale, bend forward and down. Take the left leg back into plank pose. Exhale, drop the knees, chest and chin down. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inward head B. Soft bend in your knees, look in between your palm, hop or step forward. Touch the head to the knees and exhale. Inhale, stretch the arms up, look at your thumb. Exhale, last round, bend forward and down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release the palms down. Take the legs behind into plank pose. Exhale, Chaturanga or knees, chest, chin down. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted V. Rotate the left toe 45 degrees. Step the right leg forward in between the palm. Lift the arms up towards the ceiling. Exhale, bend forward and down. Take the right leg behind into plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest, chin or Chaturanga. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted V. Rotate your right toe 45 degrees. Step the left leg forward. Inhale, lift the arms up. Exhale, bend forward and down. Take the leg behind into plank pose. Exhale, drop the knees, chest and chin down. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, lift the hips up, inverted V. Hold your inverted V for five, four, three, two, one, have a soft bend in your knees, look in between your palm, hop or step forward. Touch the head to the knees and exhale. Inhale, stretch the arms up, look at your thumb. Exhale, relax the palms by your sides. Now just watch me for some time. So you're going to come and stand at the back of your mat. Lift the arms up, inhale, exhale, bend forward. Walk your palms forward, just halfway position. Bend your elbow at 90 degree. You can come on your toe as well and take a push-up. You're trying to touch your forehead to the ground, exactly in between your palm. One. Walk your palms forward, all the way down. Push yourself up. Walk your palms back and stand up. Again, you bend forward. Walk your palm halfway. Take a shoulder push-up. Walk your palms forward all the way down. Press with your palm and leg. Lift yourself up. Walk your palms back and inhale up. Now, the challenging part is going to be this. When you go down and press yourself up. If it is too difficult, tuck in your toe. Come on your knee. 
press your chest, then your knee up. I'll show again. Tuck in your toe, lift your hip up, lift the chest, lift the knee. That is the only way of doing it a bit easily. Okay, let's try this out 10 rounds. Lift the arms up, inhale, exhale, bend forward. Walk halfway, only halfway to the mat. Now take a push up, touch your forehead down or the crown of the head down in between your palms. Now walk your palms forward into plank all the way down on your stomach. Lie down on your stomach. Now press up into plank pose. Good, very nice. Walk your palms back and inhale, stand up. Good, two, bend forward. Walk halfway, take a shoulder push up, touch your head down, walk your palms forward, plank all the way down. Press yourself up and walk your palms back. Inhale, stand up. Good. Exhale, two, bend forward, walk your palms forward, halfway, take a push up. Good. Walk your palms forward into plank. All the way down. Press up into plank. Walk your palms back. And stand up. Four. Bend forward. Walk your palms forward. Halfway. Take a push up. Keep your palms wide apart so that your head can come down. Now walk your palms forward into plank. All the way down, press up into plank, walk your palms back and stand up. Five, bend forward halfway. Palms wide apart, touch your head down. Walk your palms forward, all the way down, press up, walk your palms back and stand up. Six, bend forward, halfway walk, take a push up, palms wide apart. Walk your palms forward into plank, all the way down, press up, walk your palms back and stand up. Seven, bend forward. Walk your palms forward, halfway, take a push up. Walk your palms forward into plank, all the way down. Press up, walk your palms back and stand up. Eight, bend forward. Halfway, take a push up. Walk your palms forward. All the way down, press up into plank, walk your palms back and stand up. Nine, bend forward, halfway, touch your forehead down, walk your palms forward, all the way down, press up, walk your palms back and stand up. Last one. Bend forward, walk your palms forward, halfway, take a push up, walk your palms forward, plank all the way down, press up, walk your palms back and stand up. All right, that's it. Very nice. Well done, all of you. Good job. Now, for the next one, we are moving on to some core exercise. We are going to lie down on the back. And we'll keep our one leg up towards the ceiling. Other leg is going to be close to the ground. Keep your stomach in, lower back pressing into the ground. Lift your arms up and all you have to do is pulse your body towards the leg. One, two, three, four. We'll do this 20. Change the leg. Again, pulse the body for 20. Again, change the leg. 20. Again, change the leg. 20. So total 80 times we are going to be doing this. 
Okay. If you get tired, you can obviously take a break. Let's lie down on the back. Firstly, keep your stomach in, push your lower back down, then lift your right leg straight up towards the ceiling, left leg slightly above the ground. You need to engage your back and core muscles. Now stretch your arms in front of you, lift your head up, chest up. Start pulsing your upper body. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Switch the length, left leg up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Take a break. I cannot see the struggle anymore. <laughs> Relax yourself. Breathe. Give yourself some time. Then we'll do the next part. Breathe. Try to control your breath while you're doing the movement. If your breath is under control, you can sustain it for a longer period of time. So make sure whenever you lift up, you exhale. And in between two lifts, you are inhaling as well. Sometimes we forget to breathe and our muscles start contracting so much that we cannot hold the pose. Okay? So make sure you're breathing naturally. Now lift your right leg up. Left leg close to the ground. Head up, chest up. Stretch your arms in front of you. Now start pulsing. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Switch the leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That's it. Relax yourself. Breathe. If your neck is hurting, roll your head side to side. At any point, you feel like dropping your head down. That's all right. Please take your time while doing this, these poses and make sure you're breathing naturally. We have to do one more set because we are taking breaks in between. So whenever you're ready, let's finish the third set. Lift your right leg up, left leg above the ground, arms in front of you and begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Switch the side. Left leg up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That's it. Relax yourself. Roll your head side to side. I know it was difficult. Roll your head. Now we'll do some more strength exercises. So our next exercise is this. We are going to come into plank pose. Touch the right knee to the left elbow. Left knee to the right elbow. And we keep doing this for 30 rounds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, 30 rounds of this and obviously make sure that your shoulders are not far back because if your shoulder is behind your wrist, then you won't be able to reach your elbow. You have to keep your shoulder on top of the wrist to reach your elbow. Okay, let's try this out. 30 counts. Come into plank pose, head to toe straight line.
Three, two, one, begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four. 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. That's it. Very nice. Relax yourself. You can take a child's pose. Keep your hands by your sides. Drop the forehead on the ground. Slowly lift your head up, chest up. We'll be moving on to core exercise. For the next one, we are going to lie down on the back. Place the palms behind the head and do cross cycling or cross crunches. It looks like this. One, two, three, four. Okay, so you're touching your opposite elbow to the knee. 30 rounds. And then we take a break. Lie down on your back. Keep your knees bent, feet hip distance apart. Place your palms behind your head. And let's begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. That's it. Very nice. Relax yourself. Breathe. Now just watch me for the next one. So you're going to keep your palms right below the shoulders. And you're going to sink your chest down to touch your shoulder blades together. Only your chest. And then you're going to lift your chest back so that your shoulder blades separate. Again, you'll sink your chest down, touch your shoulder blades together. Separate your shoulder blades, push the shoulders away from each other, okay? Now, if this feels comfortable for you, you'll do the same thing in the plank pose. You'll relax your chest down, touch your shoulder blades together, and then separate your shoulder blades apart. When I say this, do not bend your elbow. Your elbows are not doing anything. You're just keeping your shoulders together, shoulders apart. Shoulders together, shoulders apart, okay? So we'll start on the knees and if it works out, then we'll try out in plank. So let's try out on the knees. Palms right below the shoulder, squeeze your stomach in. Now relax your shoulders so that your shoulder blades come together. Separate your shoulder blades apart, push your chest up. Relax your chest down. Push your chest up. Relax the chest down. Push your chest up. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Two more. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Two more. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Last one. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Hold it here. Separate your shoulder blades. Now take your legs back coming into plank pose. Head to toe straight line. Again, try to do the same thing. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Relax the chest down. Keep your elbows completely straight. Elbows are not bending. Push the chest up. Relax the chest down. 
push the chest up. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Two more. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. Last one. Relax the chest down. Push the chest up. That's it. Very nice. Take a child's pose. Relax your wrist. So we are switching between core exercise and strength exercise. So now we'll move on to core exercise. Next core exercise is this. So you're going to lie down on the back. Keep your knees bent. Whenever you lift up, touch your one toe. So it looks like this. One, switch, two, three, four, five, six. So whenever you lift up, you alternate your toe and you touch one of the toes. Okay, let's begin. Lie down on your back. Keep your knees bent, feet on the ground. Let's start in three, two, arms above your head. One, begin. One, two, try to sit up. Three, four, five, six, seven, very good, eight, Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20. That's it. Very nice. Relax yourself. Breathe. Good. We have one last exercise that we are going to do on the arms. And then we are free to try out our pose, peak pose. This is very simple. All you have to do is stomach in, tailbone tucked in. Stretch the arms up towards the ceiling, okay? You're facing your palms up. Push your shoulders up towards your ears. And you're going to lift the right knee into the chest. Straighten out the right leg. Hold yourself here. Keep pushing your arms up. And hold it here for 10 counts on the right, 10 counts on the left. You'll get to know why we are doing this. Let's try this out. Hmm. Good. Stomach in, tailbone tucked in. Lift your right knee up, straighten out your right leg, arms up. Keep your palms facing away. It's like you're pushing the ceiling away. Hold it here for 10. Squeeze the stomach in. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Keep pushing the ceiling away. Four, three, two, one. Relax your hand, relax the leg down. Very nice. Switch the side. Again, stomach in, tailbone tucked in. Bend your left knee, straighten out the left leg. Lift the arms up. Push the ceiling away. Consciously push it away. It's like the ceiling is falling and you're pushing it away. Ten. Nine, squeeze the belly in, don't push the hip forward. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Relax your palm down. Very nice. Now, something similar, but on our back, and it is called as banana hold. So you're going to lie down on your back, keep your stomach in. Tailbone tucked in, stretch out your leg, stretch out your arm and hold. Stay here in this position for 20 counts. Two rounds only. This is the last. After this, we'll try the peak pose. Lie down. 
Keep your knees bent to start with. Squeeze the belly in. Keep your lower back touching. Lift your legs 45 degree. Arms above your head and hold. Stay here. One. Above your head. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That's it. Relax yourself down. If your back was hurting, that means you have to push your lower back more onto the ground. Your lower back is not touching. That's why it is hurting. Let's try the second round. Keep your belly in. Push the lower back down. Lift the legs up, arms above your head, and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That's it. Relax yourself. And breathe. If your neck hurts, roll your head side to side. Okay, now it's time to try out our peak pose. So we are going to use the wall for next one. We are going to sit down. Keep our legs straight. Keep your feet touching the wall. Now, wherever your hip is, that is the place where you'll be keeping your palm. Keep your palm there. Now from here, lift your leg up. Stay here in this position. Look in between your palm. Lift the leg up and hold yourself here. Stay in this position. Keep breathing. Keep pushing the floor away from you. I was about to say ceiling. Keep pushing the floor away from you and hold yourself here. Stay in this position. To come out, relax your legs down. Okay, let's try this out. Same thing what we did standing. This one we are doing with the wall. When you're upside down, it's slightly difficult to figure out what goes where. So create a mental image of what you're going to do next. Where you will be in the air. Take the measurement first. Wherever you have to keep your palm. And then you climb the wall. Create an L shape with your body. Don't go too high. Little more down, Priyanka. And that's it. Very good. Lift your right leg up. Now straighten out your knee. Everyone, lift the right leg. Hold it there. Look in between your palm. Don't look at the wall. Hold it for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Relax yourself and take a break. Okay, so Priyanka, whatever measurement you took, just go a little bit closer to the wall for the next one. Hmm. Let's try the other side. Lift yourself up. Climb up the wall. Make an L shape with your legs. Feet little down, Prina, so that it is in line with your hip. Hmm. Left leg up. Hold it there. Right knee straight up, Priyanka. Hold it there. One, two. Look in between your palm. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Relax yourself. Give it a break. We'll be trying it one more time. So just take your time. Relax yourself. Gather your F courage and all the strength and try out one more time whenever you are ready. Whenever you're ready, 
lift yourself up, make an L shape. Good. Now lift your right leg up towards the ceiling. Keep looking in between your palm. Hold yourself there. 10, 9, keep pushing the floor away. 8, 7, 6, 5, stomach in. 4, 3, 2, 1. All the way down, relax yourself. Left side, lift yourself up, make an L shape. And lift your left leg up, good. Hold it there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That's it. Come out. Take a break. Relax yourself. Give yourself a longer relaxation. Relax yourself. You can take a child's pose. You can rotate your wrist. Whatever is convenient for you. Slowly lift your head up, chest up, and just watch me. Next one, lying require a lot of your strength. So I would suggest you do how much ever possible. If it seems like you cannot move any further, you have to get down. Okay. Don't test your limit in this one because it takes a bit of time to complete the entire process. So you don't have to do the entire thing. Do how much ever possible. You're going to put your palms down. Lift your legs up, walk your palm, walk your palm closer and hold yourself here. You're pushing your shoulders into your ear. Tuck in your tailbone, squeeze the belly in, look in between your palm and stay here in this position for 10 counts. If you want to come down before 10, that's okay. Walk your palms and slowly relax your leg down. So like I said, it will take a lot of your effort and if you're not comfortable don't walk all the way do how much ever you feel comfortable because i saw a couple of you were shivering while you were in the last pose. so take your time okay let's try not necessary to hold for 10 you can come down whenever you feel like now let's climb up be careful with the photo frames priyanka it is right on top all right, let's lift up. Walk as high as you can, as close as you can. And stay. Stay as long as you want. Uh, for this one, I'm not counting. It's up to you how long you want to stay or how close you want to be close to the wall. See if you can walk a little bit closer. Or just come out. If you have any energy left, try one more time. If not, lie down, relax yourself. Two options. Take it as you want. Very nice. See if you can walk a little bit closer. All right. All of you come down. Lie down on your back. Good job. You did well. Lie down. Rotate your wrist while you're lying down. Rotate your wrist in opposite direction.
Very nice. Hug your knees into the chest. Give yourself a tight squeeze. Open your arms to the side. Drop your knees to the right side. Come to center. Drop your knees to the left side. Come to center. Drop the knees to the right. Center. Drop the knees to the left side. Come to center. Once again to the right. Center to the left. Center. Relax your both legs on the ground. Keep your feet apart, palms apart, palms facing up. Relax yourself into Shavasana. 